for the people. Not some toy for billionaires. It still can be. Stay focused on what matters. Our work is going to change the world, George. I know you don't like the pageantry, but it will be worth it. He'll want control, profit. We won't let him. This is your moment. With Stark's funding and your mind, you'll be a hero to all those people. Can't you see? We are so close. Here you are. Bruce. <laughs> you disappeared this morning. There's always work to be done. I know. Always. What is it? Nothing. It's some little thing. Just getting some strange readings off the, uh, the reactor. George, maybe you were right. Maybe we were too hasty to put this on public display. Do you think we could run over the numbers just one more time? Oh, uh, yeah, yes, certainly. Thank you. I'm so sorry. This can't be our mole. She's still a liability. Oh, good. You're awake. I'm so sorry. Those synthoids were only following their security protocols. Stealing private information is a serious offense. Monica, give her a moment. Hey, what's going on? Where are you people taking me? Somewhere safe. Uh, forgive me. <laughs> I know I don't quite compare to my holographic counterpart. But it's a nice trick for the shareholders. <laughs> Dr. Tarleton? In the flesh. Why did you hack our servers? I didn't steal anything. And what were you looking for? The cure, perhaps? Kamala, AIM only wants to free us from being at the mercy of the powerful. You know, subjectivity. Unlimited power, that's dangerous. It's lethal. A-Day was a prime example. You are lucky to be alive. But with technology, we can right their wrongs. We can give you back your normal life. Look, I, I just guessed a password, okay? I, I didn't think I'd actually get in. She is clearly violent. Her infection must be getting worse. What? I, I didn't mean to hurt anyone. Of course not. But what happens when you lose control again? Hmm? What happens when you hurt someone that you love? Even the Avengers had to suffer for their hubris. Hey, were you there? I mean, when Cap died. Were you there? Yes. Luckily, Monica found me on the command deck. Her regenerative formula saved my life. Come on, Kamala. Let's do this. Yes? Let AIM help you. I'll take my chances. Damn it, George! Get the girl, now! Subject 1102 can clone herself almost perfectly, with the exception of a slight color variation in the eyes. The cells are splitting down the center, creating two separate individuals. Uh, it's, it's like the planarian flatworm, only human. Exactly. And can retain all the memories of the original subject. 0925 can create powerful bursts of energy, and, and there's at least a half a dozen with fire-based abilities. We're building an arsenal. Programmable power under our control. No more heroes, no more mistakes. It's time for another dose. I feel fine. 
You're in a coma for six months. Earlier, you could barely contain your cough. A few more doses of my regenerative formula, and your treatment will be complete. They still light candles at the base of that statue. If not for that hammer, I'd have torn the thing down. Leave it. Why have the public thinking you're still worried about the Avengers? Let my people handle it. We have a daptoid to launch. You're right. This version may be a bit more... potent. Is it stabilized? Almost. Incredible! How are you feeling? I've never felt better. Your synthetics were useless. If you'd let me deal with the Hulk and Khan earlier, the Archive would still be standing. Watch your words. You no longer make the rules. He does. When I was young, I found an orphaned wolf cub in the forest behind our farm. What? Dad said it was too dangerous. He told me to get rid of it. I fed that cub. I named him. I watched him play with my beloved dog, Darwin. You're wasting my time. I felt if I could instill rules, the proper boundaries, I could harness the raw power of that beast. Have you done rambling? Oh, oh. A few months later, while hunting, the adolescent cub turned on me, snarling, frothing at the mouth. Darwin bought me a few precious moments to call for help. My dad shot the wolf, but it was too late. Darwin had been torn to pieces. George. We need him. I'm sorry. I don't know what came over me. Leave. Please. I'm giving you something better. The launch of the Adaptoids will be the perfect distraction. <clears throat> and after? Without proof that your cure works, words like terrorism are being bandied about in some of my circles. Oh, it will work, Senator. I have the utmost confidence in Dr. Rappuccini's abilities. How much of that was a lie? The effect of the gas is still only temporary. And without my formula to keep them alive, well... The gas kills them. This isn't working. That gas gave us the adaptoid. My formula kept you alive. Now, if I could isolate how it manifests within the inhumans, I know I can reverse the effects. There are more opportunities here. We have enough powers harvested to build your army. It's time we cut our losses. Shut it down. Girl, Monica. Oh, not so easy as that. Monica, you've got a lot to answer for. Where did you move the Inhumans? Wouldn't you like to know? Damn it. You won't get off that easy. I've got a special guest here. Binder. 
She's coming with us. Well, this should be interesting. Still spoken since the hearings. Think Bruce is up to it? He better be. Once we break up Tarleton's little party, he'll clean house. The AIM experience. So many better names. Look, we need the location of that lab. Hundreds of inhumans depend on it. So tiny dancer, huh? Let me guess, you would have gone with Rocket Man. Please, not even close. You're my candle in the wind. Show's about to start. Let me guess. You're planning a big reveal at the Adaptoid launch. The triumphant return of the Avengers. Imprisonment and torture. That's how AIM's gonna make the world a better place. Please. Ebola, smallpox, polio, all fatal, if not for lab rats. And humans aren't sick, Monica. You're just harvesting their powers to make your little robots. <laughs> robots that possess complex AI. Capable of assessing the most effective application of their powers. All with minimal human casualty. Where's the lab, Monica? You can reverse engineer Terrigen, sure. But it'll be catastrophic and you know it. You were there on A-Day, and you know if we do it again, it's not gonna just endanger in humans, it's gonna endanger all of us. Last I checked, A-Day was your mess. <sighs> Damn it. Gonna need a stronger table. I see some things haven't changed. Everything's just an experiment with you, isn't it? It is. Tarleton and humans. Me. the Earth, you will not find our lab. The Adaptoids will launch, Bruce. Saving the world requires sacrifice! Generative formula. George? How long have I been your lab rat? I knew you'd react like this. You'd rather die than need something from them. I trusted you. You saved your life. You can control machines with your mind. Just think of you all infected me with his blood. It could have killed me. But it didn't. Remember the dream, George. How could you make me one of them? I made you strong. You stole my hope. And now... I am going to give you the same odds that I had. <laughs> I will rip the Earth of superpowers. Even if it has to end with me. 
Still here. It's so late. You were right, Cap. Terrigen was powerful stuff. Who's there? Talking to myself. Okay. Show me your secrets. Have you all completely lost your senses? Ah. Prodigal son returns. You almost obliterated all of Manhattan! Well, holier than thou, where were you while the world went to hell? Coming to terms with my failings, not making new ones. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Everyone just take a breath. We planned on interrupting the AIM experience, showing the world what Tarleton was up to. These adaptoids of his, they harvest their powers through the torture of these inhumans. They expose them to near lethal amounts of dark terrigen. Yeah, and that is only step one. Georgie Boy is gearing up for a war. And what's worse is, Kamala here has found some evidence that might show what really happened to Steve. Hi. Every hero has to start somewhere. You remember me? Aye. Show me this footage. Jarvis? Are you done? I have broken the encryption, so there is more to see. George! 
We have to shut down the reactor. It's pulling us towards that heat signature. Uh, I've tried, but there's no way to disengage the crystal. And get out. And seal the door. What? George, go. No. This can't be right. Head to the command deck! What? Evacuate! No! No, 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 Cap, what are you doing? No, 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 no! Just stop. What? Smashed the reactor. He had to have a reason. What reason? Hundreds of people were infected. People died, Nat. Just take it easy. Did you take some responsibility, Tony? Well, there's the Bruce I know. Throw everyone under the bus, why don't you? No, it's not the time. No, it's okay, Nat. See, he's been waiting to do this since Golden Acres, haven't you? Haven't you? This is our fault. All of ours. How do you not get that? Hey, what I get is that you actually believe all that crap you said at the hearing. I believe that we are dangerous. You really think the world is better without us? Yes. I'm out of here. You all have not changed. Look at her. She can't be fixed. She can't be cured. I've done the experiments. I've checked our DNA over and over and over again. You and I created the perfect disease. No, actually, I do the job. I make the tough decisions. Do it. I stand by the people who made me who I am. I am warning you. <laughs> Bruce? Make you angry? <laughs> See, it's always been your problem. Run from who you are, what you are. Maybe that's why. Monica got the better of you. I was just agreeing with you, big guy. That banner is a coward. Guys, don't do this. This is exactly what Tarleton wants. I'd stay out of this one, kid. Can keep this thing in.